So this is how I have everything wired up. Now with all the components soldered on to the receiver, I will be able to feed them and put them in place in, into the chassis. All right, so I think I finally got everything in place. Um, I have the headlights, or in this case, the fog lights and the rear bumper lights hot glued in. Battery set up front here with the uh, rotating servo. I have my front cross member. Now the, the motor is a lot bigger than the other one that I've been using, so this one actually sticks out the back a lot, as you can see. And now the on and off switch is on this side. And I basically just hot glue it in. Uh, it's just so it won't walk on me or move out of place. So it's actually a pretty nice fit. It's not too snug. It's not too loose. And I think this will do for now. Now I finally got everything together there were a bunch of things that I needed to adjust and I had to modify a lot of other things as far as the cross members I had to modify the dry shaft and also the music wire and the frame or the chassis was actually sand down a lot on both sides just so I can get this to work So this is normally the test I like to do, is see if it can go over the uh, rocks here. Nope. All right, so I turned the rocks around just so it can get on the rocks. Climbed over very easily. So as you can tell, this thing is very top heavy and it seems to like to topple over very easily.